concept of cardiometabolic risk has been introduced uh, several years ago, and it was originally based on coronary artery disease, vascular disease. But the more we dig in this field, the more we realize that visceral obesity and associated metabolic abnormalities have impact on other target organs. And uh, uh, what about the valvulo metabolic risk? This is a concept that we introduced uh, a few years ago with uh, my colleagues and friends, uh, uh, Patrick Mathieu and Jean-Pierre Desprez at the Quebec Heart and Lung Institute. And sensu stricto, the valvulo metabolic risk can be defined as the risk of valvular heart disease uh, caused by the metabolic abnormalities uh, linked to uh, visceral obesity. And in this context, we uh, found that there is a strong association uh, between visceral obesity and metabolic syndrome and faster progression of uh, calcific aortic stenosis, a higher rate of events in these patients with uh, valvular disease. And also, we, interestingly, we found that this valvular metabolic risk persist beyond aortic valve replacement because when the aortic stenosis becomes severe, uh, we replace the valve by a, a biological prosthesis made of porcine or bovine tissue. And uh, well, interestingly, uh, we, this the disease uh, continue on, the, on, the, on this bioplastic valve and the bioplastic valve degenerates faster in these individuals with visceral obesity and, and associated metabolic abnormalities. And also, uh, the, this, this metabolism has an impact on the ventricle as well, not only on the valve. We tend to focus on the valve and think that this disease is strictly limited to the valve, but of course this is a continuum and the valvular metabolic risk also impacts the adverse impact on the ventricle, the valve and the vascular component as well.